Now we're here. We've actually landed at the Central Light Town Terminal. The building is actually pretty cool. It has two entrances, one from the bridge to Light Town, which I should probably show you. So if you had taken the road to Light Town, you would come across this bridge, looking at the rail and everything. And when you come in, you see welcome signs, and you can take a map. That area on the top left, or just on the left of Light Town, that's Crotomo's Trail, it's that big tree area. We were there before. And testing is that big white block at the bottom with the red block, which is lava, you know, near it. So let's take a rip because that's a great way to look around the city. And let's first go to Lower Light Town because that was built first. See, that's a prison over there. And that's Kodomo's cabin, I think. This is the discount electronics store. So this is the second current rail tunnel. It's still under construction. Okay, so discount electronics. The first business in Light Town. They've got a giant TV, tiny TV, pictures. And this is supposed to be shelves of electronics that are so small you can't even see them. Like in the App Store. <laughs> like in the Apple Store. So this crazy huge building was built by Red Battle. And it's an automobile shop. So this is the first car for sale. It's huge. It's a double-decker bus. Wow, you can see the sunset. And because this is such a pain to navigate, I'm gonna use a phone. Oh look, we're on the next floor now. This is a mini, a mini car. And you get in, and you're in, and that's it. <laughs> Nothing, no space at all. The smallest car you could make. Formula One. Street racing. Well, not street racing. Just racing. Above. Whoa. And this is a plane? No, this is a limo. The plane is upstairs. The limo has a jacuzzi in it. And a ton of torches. Just begging you to light the place on fire. Now, now we're upstairs, and it's foggy in here because there's a cloud passing through. Okay, so... Okay. Alright, so now we're done. Now I can jump off. Yeah. Okay, so this is the famed boardwalk along the beach. This is the lemonade hut. This is a seafood restaurant. Very luxurious restaurant. Here's the, the restaurants. The men's room is super tiny, while the ladies' room is the same thing except there's a hallway to it. Here's the pizza shack, on a, a pizza restaurant. And they actually have their furnaces on because they have customers. <laughs> the burrito bar, basically my emulation of the Chipotle restaurant chain. It's a very good restaurant. Next shop is the Light Town Souvenirs. 
nothing but top quality souvenirs for all the travels. Super cold ice cream, which is a pretty lame name for our ice cream restaurant. <laughs> I guess I was running out of ideas by then. Here's the Epic Wonders clothing store. All the clothes you could ever want. And the last stop is the cotton candy pool. Who doesn't like cotton? Now this is a little tiny beach. I'm not sure if I'll build anything here. But the real action is over at the family beach. Alright, now it's a day at the beach. First, we have the volleyball. You can actually pick up a volleyball, which is actually a snowball, and start throwing it. Okay, so we got a bunch of umbrellas and a lifeguard. We got two lifeguards. We got one way over there to watch all the swimmers and make sure this. And if you look at the map, you'll see that over there is the dock that we went to in Koromo's Park. You can see the dock on a map, and that's it. So this is a, what's called the Lake of Light. Kind of, I've always been a critic of that, I thought it was boring. We could have used that spot for something better. Protomo's Cabin. Light Town Prison. Time. This is kind of weird for a prison. These are the cells. There's really nothing in there, not even a bed. This Light Town is not nice to its criminals. <laughs> Hey look, this one has a bed. That's the only one though. We must have gotten something. Now these hatches up here, apparently they're for feeding the inmates. Oops, oh great, now I'm trapped. There's no way out except through something. So this is a baker. And it's actually pretty nice. Menu. You can see the kitchen back there, and you can eat outside. Very nice restaurant. So, someone's building something there, it's currently not done. But I'm gonna go take the upper light time. That's the nightclub. That's the hardware store. And this is the upper terminal. I guess I'll get out the old fashioned way. What? I can't get out? Oh, that's stupid. <laughs> so there's the guy guy statue. I'll take you there later. But this is how you get in, you have to push this. And then the pistons go away. It's not very useful. I mean this is a terminal, not a house. So here's the hardware store. I really like how the, the light rail is supported by it's actually supported by stuff. The light rail in Young City is just a flying track. Now it's completely dark in here. And you can't see anything except the floor. And this is supposed to be like a disco floor. It's really great how they came up with this. I think it was Crow. I think that's everything in Light Town. Everything so far. 
So now that you got your tour of light tower, we can go on to the, the statue. But instead of warping to there, I'm gonna see if there's a rail that I can take. To Ardo and Bedina. That's the town next to that. What? No button. That looks really cool. I'm, I'm talking about the giant building, not the statue. <laughs> the statue really is kind of scary. You're just walking around and then the statue comes up on the horizon. You think it's a guy, but it's not. <laughs> We're here. Arnold and Ididina. Okay, so this is D52 Memorial Bridge. Now, I think the most insulting part of this bridge is the fact that it's not finished or anywhere near finished. It looks like it was destroyed actually. And was Guy Guy the one to blame? Did he destroy the bridge? <laughs> this is supposed to be a Guy Guy statue. And apparently, he's holding a diamond sword. So, this is uh, this is what Crotomo made right after getting rolled out. This giant mall. It looks like a hospital in my opinion, but it's a mall. And every floor is basically the same because you use copy paste to roll that. Now, if, I personally think that the stores need big windows because that's how it's like in malls. And so, right now it just feels like a giant office building doesn't look very commerce friendly. So yeah, each floor, and then the stairs just stop, and you get the feeling like you're in a parking garage. <laughs> Although, there is one floor that goes out to the balcony, and I'm guessing this is going to be the food court, because it's going to be really cool. I haven't seen this building, I don't know what it is. Let's see where it is. Yeah, no sign. It's under construction. I'm not sure who's planning this. So there's Crotomo's towers. He actually finished them. Maybe I should show you the finished product. And I think I have a, a room here. Yeah, this is my room. I filled it. I need to fill it with stuff. Otherwise it's just boring. Alright, so back to the trip. 